Birmingham District Energy Scheme is pivotal in making Birmingham a greener city. The scheme features tri-generation, producing heat, electricity and chilled water to a number of prestigious buildings in the city centre, including the Town Hall, the Council House and the Library of Birmingham. The scheme is made up of three separate district heating networks, Broad Street, Eastside and Birmingham Children's Hospital. And we're currently in the process of interconnecting the Broad Street scheme with the Eastside scheme, also incorporating Birmingham New Street Station into the system. The benefits for businesses of being on the scheme include energy and whole life cost savings, carbon savings and space savings, as there's no requirement for on-site plants. The interconnection presents a number of opportunities for the scheme to incorporate and add on new buildings and entities onto the system which would further decarbonise the city centre. So Seven Trent Water, hopefully most people recognise us as a company that serves the Midlands for water supply and, and waste removal. But what a lot of people don't know about us is that we also have a part of the business where we generate renewable energy from people's waste. So in Birmingham we treat 2.1 million people's worth of sewage sludge here at our main site at Minworth in, in Sutton Coalfield. The waste comes down the sewers to us every single day. We remove the, the solid parts of that and we treat it in a process known as anaerobic digestion. Anaerobic digestion is like a series of giant cow stomachs which contain a lot of bacteria. Those bacteria break down the waste and give off methane gas. We can then use that methane gas to either power our, our combined heat and power engines and what that allows us to do is reduce customers' bills and to, to make sure we run it in the most efficient manner. Or we can clean it up and put it into the national grid where it's as good as natural gas in the network. Going forward we have a very large expansion programme that we're looking to do. Seven Trent Water is investing another £190 million over the next five years looking at expanding our, our operations in renewable energy. Norfolk Eco Centre was set up in 2009 by Central England Quakers to work with the local community to help them create more sustainable ways of living. We've always focused around sort of energy, uh, sort of gardening and food growing. The food growing has kind of started here in the garden where we've kind of taken a piece of wasteland and slowly developed it. Uh, two years ago we got some funding to plant trees in the local area which was fruit and nut trees that are all in publicly accessible areas so in theory people could go and have free food at, at points. And there's going to be some community gardens where people can all go and there'll be courses and projects run from there. But also they'll be supporting people to grow food in their own gardens and giving them all the advice and knowledge and seeds. So we do two lots of energy assessments. We do what they're called domestic, which is housing and people's homes, and non-domestic, which is everything from public buildings, businesses, museums, churches, and also we've got some project funding to look at fuel poverty and helping people reduce their bills. 